night, all three Westchester Township trustees shot down a proposal to build a Kroger in an empty field at the intersection of Tylersville and Princeton Glendale Roads. Nine on your side reporter Amy Wattis was there when the trustees voted. Amy. Clyde, behind me is the Kroger on 747 in Westchester that would have closed if trustees would have approved a proposal to build a Kroger marketplace down the road. Now tonight I spoke to residents and they say they're breathing a sigh of relief that this is not going to happen. From Chopper 9, you're looking at the 36.3 acre plot of land where a Kroger marketplace would have gone. But that's no longer the case. Three Westchester Township trustees say they're looking out for the citizens. We're very excited that the trustees listened. These trustees say they have good reason why they're against the crossings at Beckett. The developer of the proposal says the project would have been done in two phases. The first phase would have consisted of Kroger Marketplace and a few other stores. It's the second phase that got the trustees worried. So their plan was to get the Kroger built and years later, if ever, we couldn't even get a time commitment out them, construct all the buffering at a future point in time. The buffering would have consisted of a park, landscaping and sidewalks to block out the noise between the shopping center and nearby homes. Diane Grimes is relieved it's not going to happen. It's really going to hurt all those businesses around there. My friends own the Taco Bell right out in front of the, the Kroger's there and you know they just did a big remodel on it. I'm sure they don't want to see Kroger's moving. That would definitely hurt their business. Deb Lawrence is all for something else going up on this plot of land. If we continue to keep it and to its true form, which is residential mixed use, we can get something that might be more like a, a I'm thinking library or church or something much more downgraded than a big box store. And the trustees say their no vote doesn't mean that another developer can't come along with a new proposal to build on the land. He says that this most likely will happen in the future. Amy Wattis, Nine on Your Side, live from Westchester.